Welcome back to Houston Life. For more than 40 years, our next guest has been sharing his talents with viewers on PBS and online, teaching the art of 3D drawing. And now there's a brand new documentary honoring his life and incredible career. Emmy Award winning artist Mark Kistler is joining us once again in Studio B. Now, I wasn't lucky enough to be here last time you were here, Mark, so welcome. It's so nice to have you. Derek and Tessa, I'm so excited ah, to be back here. <laughs> yeah, last year when I was here, I taught the two wonderful hosts how to draw a fish. So today, after our brilliant interview, we're going to draw a toucan. You called it. So, yeah. We love toucans. So, Mark, I know a lot of our viewers are probably freaking out right now because they feel like they know you and grew up yeah. with you. Draw, draw, draw. And <laughs> really, I mean, you were responsible for sort of a de defining era in instructional television teaching people the art of 3D. And on mm. PBS, alongside Mr. Rogers and Sesame Street, how did your your career begin? And Bob Ross. <laughs> and Bob Ross. Yeah. I cannot forget the legendary yeah. Bob Ross. Yeah. How did your career begin? Well, it just, it, what's um, very exciting is that I was able to convey on through television when I, at a young age that anyone really can learn how to draw if you learn some skills. And I was really fortunate that I got selected back in 1988, 40-something years ago, to do the Secret City series. And I was Commander Mark, this, the, the jacket here. The jacket's and fresh. I, isn't that, I just got to <laughs> give a shout out real quick to Yvonne and Ken. I'm glad you guys are watching our executive producers of the, with that movie you were talking about. Isn't that crazy cool? The documentary. After 40 years, the, with uh, Jason Brown, the director, put together this amazing kind of a retrospective 40 years of my three different PBS shows. And we actually won the best documentary at the San Diego Comic-Con Film Festival, the International wow. Film Festival. Isn't that crazy cool? That's insane. That, that's crazy cool. And you said you were so lucky to be picked, but I mean, you had something special. Now, in the days of YouTube, someone can say, okay, well, I'm going to teach people to do this or that, and people kind of pick their own. But you really raised so many kids that were watching PBS. You were very much a point person to that. How does that feel when you look at that retrospectively? Oh, it is it's so validating. In the movie, we were so lucky to have uh, these, these young artists who grew up to become professional artists. Jack Moore from NASA and Dan Frega from Image Comics. He grew up and he became the Spider-Man, Batman, uh, Silver Surfer ad. Tim Decker, who animated uh, um, <laughs> the... Uh, It'll a lot. Really. Uh, okay. Simpsons and Disney oh, wow. and all kinds of stuff. And Doug DeVore. We just had so many great talent from the young, from their young age when they're growing up watching the show and got inspired and they molded their whole career after their passion for the visual arts. And, I, and I'm really excited and validated that I was able to be a bit of that inspiration, that spark yeah. that got him to draw. And Mark, in many ways, your career and your effect and influence on people is kind of intangible, right? I mean, you'll never really know how many millions of people who you touched and whose lives you affected. When you were approached about doing this documentary, because that does not happen to most people. Yeah. Most people do not get an email. Yeah. Their, their lives aren't interesting enough <laughs> to get approached to be the subject of a documentary. It's got to be so flattering for for someone to invest the time and the resources to really tell your story. Is that the moment when it really hit you? Like, hey, yeah, I, I have really impacted a lot of people's lives. Oh, it is, it's wonderful and it's validating. And the emails I get still after all these years, so, you know, from the reruns on Amazon Prime to um, the, uh, I'm doing my lives now, which is exciting. I do my, I go into YouTube every day and I have this campaign of one drawing every day. And I get these emails from people from Portugal and, you know, Saudi Arabia and um, Russia and India that they remember watching the show from so many years ago. And they're, here they are with their children watching the next generation again. So it's just it's, it's exciting and it is um, uh, humbling to know that millions and millions of kids grew up and become became more creative and some of them actually pursued visual art careers in animation and graphic design, interior design, fashion design. So that's wonderful. Because of you, yeah. they did that. Commander Mark. <laughs> now, you, your catchphrase, dream it, draw it, do it. You really believe that. You Absolutely. really believe that. No, seriously, yeah. because not everyone has that, you know, people see me do crafts on this show all the time. But you really believe that anyone, yeah. if taught right, can, can draw. 
not only can they draw, they can make their dreams come true. You know, you have, it's so it's just so powerful to have a dream and to love what you do. Obviously, you and Derek Tessa, you guys love what you do. You're very magnetic and energetic, and I love what I do. We're so lucky to do what we love to do. So I try to influence all my viewers and my fans to find something they love to do, use their creativity, use their imagination, and use all that passion and love they have inside them to make that dream come true. It's amazing what you can do. Here I am, 60 years old and I'm still drawing two cans, which we'll be doing in a second, and fish, still drawing in 3D <laughs> after 44 years, all because of a dream. You know, I had this dream when I was 18 to teach a million kids how to draw. And through that process of, you know, relentless pursuit of your dream, of my dream, that uh, it was able to come true. Now, for 2024, I have my goal of draw more, in 2024. So I'm just telling everybody, you know, follow me on YouTube, subscribe on YouTube. My goal again is a million subscribers to draw in 2024. Every day I go live. So you can draw with me live tonight. If you like this toucan drawing, we'll do the toucan tonight for you guys. If you guys join me, my uh, YouTube channel. That is Very a really cool, cool and it's free. idea. You know, it's yeah. free for the world. And your career while you are still doing the same sort of art form, it's incredible how you have evolved to embrace new technology. I mean, in 1986, when you first started doing TV, could you have imagined the interactive element that you were able to capture by going live on YouTube every day? It's oh, incredible. I'm doing a TV show every night. I'm, you know, directing and producing and doing it all with a laptop computer. I even go for my iPhone when I'm traveling. Like when I was in India doing a tour, I, every, I just had a little tripod iPhone when I was, and I would do my live lessons. So it's, it is wonderful technology that you can reach so many people with it. It's wonderful also to be able to flash back and show the, you know, the 80s stuff, the, the, the way we were doing it old school and to be able to refer to it. So that's just another reason to watch the documentary. Yeah, I watch that like, movie yeah. and I see the mustache, you know, and the, the mustache. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it looks so, good. It well, with the documentary. Oh, there it is. There's, there's that handsome devil. Yeah, you can, there you can right see the, the trailer Kistler. on my website at markkistler.com. Oh, it just came out. Of, it's available on amazon.com right now the DVD. Ah, I'm so excited. Apple TV, <laughs> I'm Prime. When we come back, March is teaching us how to draw. That's coming up next. We're going to try. Welcome back to Houston Life. If you're just joining us, we've been hanging out with 3D artist and educator Mark Kistler and chatting about his brand new ah. documentary, The Secret Cities of Mark Kistler, which was just released today. Congratulations. Isn't that exciting? It's out on Amazon and uh, all the websites. So, it, anyways, I'm going to teach you guys how to draw an awesome toucan and to proof anyone can draw. You guys really can draw. So get your light. We start with a light pen. Got it. And very lightly, watch this. We're just going to draw a branch. Just draw a just branch. Like, we're going to start really light, 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 light. Okay. And then we'll darken it in. We'll draw the, the little thickness of the branch. Okay. Look at this, that confidence. Drawing is fun. Drawing is joyful. Just enjoy it. So Don't joy. worry about making mistakes. Okay, I really Don't did. worry about making mistakes. Okay. Give yourself permission to draw, to draw, to explore. Okay. Look at that. That's perfect. Gorgeous. Oh, you professionals. Now, like a shark. We're just we're just blocking in the toucan's beak here. Okay. Okay. Give yourself permission to make mistakes. Just doodle and noodle and enjoy it. Okay. Enjoy the creative process. It's been so long then, since I've drawn then I'm anything. Draw the little wing. Okay. And then back here, this is called size. This wing is smaller. It's further way back behind there. Okay. All right, here, switch. Get a dark pen now. Okay, here so you go, So what we did, we did the light lines, okay. and now we're going to go through the dark. This is called overlapping, this side right here. And at this point, I usually hear my producer, Robert Newstead, in my ear, and he's not here now, so I'm lost. Uh -huh. I'm Robert out there. <laughs> and there's Jeff Roberts and Amanda out there, too, drawing with us. Let's draw the feathers. Heather. See that? Draw the wings. Isn't this fun? It is so, fun. It's so it's fun, much fun, fun. fun. Little, just little wiggles. I love oh your feathers. God. Very, very, Thanks. very cool. All right, now we're going to draw that toucan beak. They could, that's called the contour line. Oh. There's 12 Ooh, like ideas, 12 words of drawing. And if you learn these words, you can draw anything. Now look at curvy. Here's another one. 
these little toes are curved contour lines. If you learn these words, these are the words that I teach every night live on my YouTube channel. It's called Mark Kistler Live. What a stretch for a definition, right? <laughs> and then here. It's a good title. I'm so, going to take your YouTube I'll class. be on usually in the evening. Isn't that fun? Cool. That's smaller. This is closer and that's further away. Oh, smaller. And draw your eyes. Bigger. Now, and then you can draw the tail. Now, we have a, just oh. a little bit of time. Grab your blue pen again. Oh, I think okay. I got behind. Grab your blue pen again and we'll shade underneath that wing. See this? Isn't shading fun? That'll help define your, your shape. See, shade under the wing. Shade the back wing. Shade under the eye. Oh, that's the eye. See this? Oh. The light's up here coming down. I forgot the dark. Look at you guys. I'm so proud of you. Thank Thanks, you. Thanks, Mark. Awesome job. Now, okay. we're using overlapping. We're using shading. And then this is a word called contour. This is the really important idea. Ready? Okay, yeah. Curve this. Curve. Curve. See this? Now, these are these are one, wonderful. Ah, I love it. <laughs> You're so confident. Love I love Mark it. Mark loves my two Curve hands. the contour. This is and really fun. And you're off and running. Look at you have the confidence. Yeah. And you have the. Well, because girls contour with makeup now. There, they, there we they go. Just there we go. Contour away. You have some guys do as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. Okay. And you can add more details. How much time do we have? I can add tons more details. I think we have a minute and a half left, Mark. Okay. So what we'll do is we're going to add a little more value to the beak. We did we did all that in three minutes. Are We're you amazed? So good. Even though you're you're I'm you're catching so it. It's okay. You're still going. I'm so you're full still going. straight away. Oh. <laughs> well, I'm proud of That's you. That's okay. No, I've got it. Now look at I'm gonna value it. I'm gonna tone it. Look at this. We're good. Sorry, We're having a little me. technical Mr. issue. It. I'm gonna value in the toucan. Okay. Isn't this great? It's so great. It's fun. I can tell Jeff Roberts is out there drawing with me too. He's our awesome. National publicity this, guy. This brings me so, calmness. Yeah, oh, I'm boy. excited for you guys to watch the documentary. Me too. It was really, really exciting and surreal to see that on the big screen in New York City. I went back for a, pre, a, a screening there, and to be in New York City and see that my name, you know, and in the, the light. It because was you, really exciting. You call Texas home now, though, right? You're you're yeah, local. Yeah, I live up in North Texas. Very cool. Very cool. Yeah, so I'm just so proud of you guys. You think I'd sign your name? This was sign really your name fun. For drawing. Sign your I'm name. gonna name my toucan. And Taylor. I brought, I brought a official movie poster for both of you. Dream oh. come true. Dreams and I bought, come true. bought each of you a book so you guys can study your drawing. Half hour pencil power and you can draw in 30 days. Just hey thank you so much for inviting me. Oh my and gosh. Thank you. Keep, keep so drawing much. every day. Okay? Dream it, draw it, do it. Yes and make your dreams come true. Mark thank Kistler, you so much. thank you so much for stopping by. We, this was really really fun. I'm going to take awesome. your YouTube class. Thank you so much. Tessa. We'll see you tonight on YouTube. <laughs> By the way, the documentary is out. It is streaming everywhere. We have posted a link on our website, HoustonLife.tv. Just look for that scene on Houston Life section. We did All it. All right. Thank Good you. Good job, Mark. You that guys. was fun. That was awesome. I'm when proud we come of you. back. Thank you. These are pencils on his jacket, by the way. <laughs> We're right going to talk about wine for date stuff. night.